Hey guys, what's up? It's Doug here again at Hybrid Fitness and today we're going to teach you how to do a 30 minute advanced back workout. So for our first group of exercises, we're going to have the seated cable row, the Cuban press, and a one arm pullover. Starting out with the cable row, I want you to grab the weight, pinch your shoulder blades back, and plant your back flat. From here, you're pulling your elbows back and the weight right to about your belly button. For our second exercise, we have the Cuban press. With the Cuban press, you're going to take and bring the elbows up to about 90 degrees. From here, rotate and then press all the way up, stopping back down at 90 degrees and rotating down and then lowering it. For our one arm cable pullover, you're gonna put your hips slightly back, and then now keeping this arm straight, we're gonna lower the, the arm all the way down, right past the thigh. It's most important to keep this arm straight, contract your lap on the way down. For our next group of exercises, we're gonna have the cable upright row and the plank row. For a cable upright row, we're gonna engage the weight, step back, pinch your shoulder blades together, keep a nice tight core, and then you're pulling your elbows high until your wrists are right around chest level, and then back down. And then we got a plank row. You're gonna grab the weight and step back with the weight. That way you engage. And when you extend, you don't clack the weight with it. So elbows back and keep a nice tight core. Our next group of three exercises is going to be the cable reverse fly, two arm dumbbell bent over row, and a dumbbell pullover. Starting out with the reverse fly, I want you to grab a little knob on each side, reach across, you're stepping back, and then now from here, pinch your shoulder blades, lock your arms into a fixed position. They don't necessarily have to be straight, but lock them into a fixed position, and then come all the way out to 180 degrees. Moving on to our two arm dumbbell bent over row. You grab the dumbbells, hips back. You're pulling from the center point of your feet. 
elbows high. For our dumbbell pullover, we want to grab the weight kind of like this with our hands, lean back, slight bend in the elbow, and from here you're going to come all the way back to feel a stretch in your lats and in your core, and then bring it all the way back up above your chest. For our dumbbell reverse fly, we're gonna push our hips back, fix our arms in so it doesn't necessarily need to be locked out, but a fixed angle. And then from here, pinching our shoulder blades and raising out to the side. So commando rows are just like renegade rows, except that there's no push-up. So we're gonna start off in a plank position with our hands on the dumbbell, feet in a wider stance to help with balance. And from here, pull an elbow high, elbow high. For our dumbbell hang muscle snatch, we're going to start with the dumbbell right in front of, our, of the same leg as the arm that's holding it. Hinge back until it's right before the knee. Now we're going to pop our hips forward, upright row, so elbow high. And then once the weight gets to about where our chest is, it's going to turn over and go straight up. So full speed, it's back down. Now there's a quick tutorial of our 30 minute advanced back workout. If you like the video or learn anything, don't forget to like, comment, and share. 30 minute advanced back workout, throw it in your routine and let me know what you think.